Now I will give you three random verses he has sent me to, and as I put these together, I am praying for you. Habakkuk 2.1 I will stand on my guard post and station myself on the rampart. I will keep watch to see what he will speak to me. I know I have said it before, and I try to keep it known. What I share, the topics that are chosen, are not of my own doing. Two years ago, the Lord called me to watch, and whenever I am given a word from Him, I am to share from Him. He has me on the topic of Him coming to take His bride, over and over again, with no fail. This is not me fixated on a subject, it's Him warning His people. Amos 9.10 All the sinners of my people will die by the sword, those who say, The calamity will not overtake us or confront us. I don't search these up at all. He takes me straight to every verse. Please prepare your heart. Check your pride. Try to see the Holy Spirit through me, warning you. Not me. I'm just a willing vessel. If the rapture or an end times topic makes you angry, bring that up with the Lord. Repent. Run away from your sin and humble yourself before the Lord. Acts 9.18 And immediately there fell from his eyes something like scales, and he regained his sight, and he got up and was baptized. Amen, Lord. I pray this for all those who are really struggling with wanting to say he's a long time coming. Even if Christians in the time of the Holocaust thought he was coming then as well, Wouldn't it be best to prepare your heart not knowing than to argue, argue, argue? I know that time is short, and what does he tell us to do knowing this? Love one another, and his perfect love comes with correction and guidance. I pray you will be guided by him. I pray that you will miraculously feel your pride fall away. I pray in Jesus' name that you will receive the baptism of the Holy Spirit right where you are, and you will receive His gifting, and you will hear from Him and be led by Him and be bold for Him. I ask, Lord Jesus, in your holy name, please have the blinders removed. You are loved, people. Please. Do not push away corrections that could come from him.